And I'm so used to being, like, everyone being able to hunt because they have bows, and bows aren't that bad. But yeah, pistols tend to just annoy the enemy. So what happened there is we ticked off the caribou enough that they decided they wanted to go on a rampage, and that rampage hurt. So Kaj is still alive. We are going to go to the manager. Work manager. We're going to turn you back into... Yeah, numbers are still there. Duh. And then we are going to disallow you from hunting. Like so. So what had we not done? We hadn't built that yet. Had I set anything to be hunted? No. I'm kind of tempted to go for the smaller prey. We'll go for a couple of hairs. We'll do that. All right, off we go. And Clark, I'm going to assume, was seen to? Yes. Good. Good. Saves coming is better than repeatedly restarting. That's true. Like, usually I, I kind of like just dealing with the um, bad stuff. But in this instance, it was a little bit too bad. Oi. No. And a chunk. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. Alright, so what was the decision? Regular chairs or stools? Hey, Val. I think we decided it was going to be chairs. I think we're actually going to need another, a bigger hauling area. And we're also going to need a hauling area for corpses. Which I think we're going to position down here for the moment. So let's go ahead and zone out a dumping stockpile. Just a relatively small one, 6x6 six six will do. Storage, clear all. Corpses. And now rotten. Low priority. So any corpses should come in here first. And then should go over there. Okay, good. Right, so we're starting to get some hairs in, which is great. The other thing we need to do is make sure that these get harvested. And that seems to have turned itself off. Drunk of spacecraft. Another one. Wow, there's a lot of spacecraft pieces falling here. There's another one there. Blimey. Okay, so lots of food supply coming in. Excellent. Next up, we can set up a production facility, which is the electric stove, which we are going to position here. And then we need the power conduits. That's what had not got done last time. Like so. Oh, and the other thing I was going to do was the mining area. Coming through here. Stores are okay at this stage, can be changed later. Well, it's not exactly... I don't exactly have a shortage of wood. So, I think I'm going to just go with a chair. Oops. Chair there. Chair there. Don't bother with the quality building. <laughs> that really doesn't matter. Did I turn the temperature down? I did not. Please do that. So these hairs and things don't go off, especially as they spoil in a day. Which will be bad. Right, you need a butcher bill, so butcher creature. Anyone... Do forever. All right then, Realis. So a chance to start getting a little bit of cooking practice. Huzzah! Need meal sauce. Need joy sauce. Right, joy. 
And that's an easy one to fix because we can just go to joy and then a horse pin or sheep pin which we can just stick uh, here. How's this dude doing? He's alright actually. I should check out your chance to recruit and we're going to say chant recruit. I think the game gives you chunks so you can get components. Yeah, quite possibly. Although I still have a fair number because I haven't used that many. Like 20 plus. I want to be named after a small animated figure in a colleague's team that will be most likely to die from an infection or a stab wound. From a dirty nude pirate who wants to steal our rocks. How dare they steal our rocks! Oh good, he waves over. I was a little bit worried about that because we do so much stuff outside but it didn't really seem to affect us. Alright, so we have lots of berries and stuff coming in, which is excellent. Um, why is this not getting built? How's your construction doing? Oh, it's level 4. It's going up pretty quickly, actually. Oh, you're industrious. Oh, that's nice. I didn't even really look at the traits, so yeah, you're the greedy shooter prostophobe. You're pretty in in industrious. So Neon, you're, you're kind of like the perfect person. Careful shooter, too smart. Too smart's annoying because you're neurotic, though you do gr learn skills faster. But for the shooter, it's... Yeah, I guess it's alright. You're an optimistic brawler. And then finally, QWERTY is the hard-working, trigger-happy teetotaler. So we have industrious and hard-working. Excellent. Yeah, ch chairs are mood bonuses. Alright, so we have a lot of people not doing anything again. Um, right, you are built. Add Bill. Cook simple meal, because I'm not trusting you to do anything better. I'm going to say realists only. And we're going to do until we have Twenty-five, with a minimum of, we'll say, fifteen. Cool. Off you go. That's going to get you a job. So next up, I think we're going to go and carve out the main storeroom, so that we can put the actual bedrooms over here. Also, we should probably set up a proper bed for our prisoner here. There can totally be an entrance through here. I think it's just slower. I'm not 100% sure though. Clock, torture is fully healed. Okay, he is walking around. It's like, I'm a little bit nervous about the fact that you're not walking around and doing stuff. But apparently you are. Good. Right, let's get these things. Whoops. Hold. There we go. Realist, why are we not making proper meals? You have the materials for it. Granted, it's not a lot, but still. Right, wildlife. We are going to clearly need to go hunting a whole bunch more, so let's go kill a couple more hares. And also... Harvest more of those, more of those. We have a good source of berries, actually. We're quite lucky for that. Realist, are you cooking? Excellent. Okay, so we're starting to get some simple meals, which will really help with morale. Good. 
good stuff. Major break risk. Eagle again. Thunderstorm. Hopefully not going to blow anything up. 14% chance of recruitment. That's actually pretty high. Uh, now that you have a bed, I'm going to go ahead and deconstruct you. Of that getting done. I'm still a little bit nervous by how... Okay, we've got loads of those still flagged. Why has this not been carried in? Just because it was forbidden. Fair enough. Right, I'd really like to get you guys some individual rooms soon. Because I think that will really help in terms of how happy you are with life, the universe, and everything. What is my construction skill? Four, four, two, zero, two. Neil was the constructor. No! Oh, it's raining. It's fine. Don't be destroying my conduits! Made a test run colony where people who had all bionics from, from one mod or whatever the people ran the break for that reason. Yeah, some of the newer mods are very, very good. Absolutely, 100%. Escape pod. Wish these were a bit louder. Dweeb! Go juice addiction. Are you worth saving? Green thumb, hard worker, pretty. Incapable of nothing. You are totally worth saving, although you are going to be a real pain to stop flipping out. Um... Yeah, definitely time for the padded box. I'm just trying to think where the hell am I going to put him. I've only got the one room spare. I mean, one thing that I could do is turn this into like an infirmary, especially now that I'm starting to get my proper storeroom set up, and put him in there. Or I could do a second layer of rooms over here, though I'm wondering if 5x5 five five is big enough. Well, these can be guest quarters and they can be prison quarters. So what we could do is have basically a second line of rooms back here. And that would be something like this. I mean, we'd need to set up some back defenses there. And that would be... outside of where I wanted my main defences to be. I mean, I could curve them around, like this, or even like that. Um, or we could start carving this into rooms, which is true, I could do that. Yeah, that's true. One wide are oh, very bad for our infestations. Um, yeah, I need to put in some of my internal shooting zones, don't I? That's a very good point. It's why one of the reasons I kind of like outdoor bases rather than these indoor ones. Hmm. 
<laughs> Put him in the indoor room where there's a pistol and a club. You know what, I'm going to just set a room up for you. One, two, three, four, five. It's going to be right there. And we'll just stick you in that room for the moment. So, Neon, let's get this built now. And secondly, Neon, what are you doing? Um, no, seriously, don't bother repairing. Stop repairing. Stop it. Right. No. Nope. Seriously, three times in a row you failed. And that one. Boom. Right, we need to. Since I remember how. Uh, it's just something I select, isn't it? Uh, with these guys, you can just take them. So this needs to be designated prisoner. Neon. Go capture Dweeb. Because you are space refugee, you're not going to get upset about it. Right, and then our medic, who is QWERTY. Prioritize tending him. Did I set no meds? Hopefully it's enough. We're having a party! Huzzah! Party's finished. I think the party was like in that bit. Bit of a weird place, but okay, whatever, whatever. Float your boat. We have two meals left. Relus is doing that, but we are still short on some of the harvested areas. Ooh, rice is almost done. Corn really isn't. Does that mean that you get two rice crops a year? Because that would be freaking awesome if that's true. All right, so if we theoretically made this into the corridor size, then we could totally get some bedrooms here. Seven by seven, make them a bit nicer. Whoops, no, that's terrible. Seven by seven reasonable? I would think so. Dweeb is no longer incapable of walking. Good. And the other thing we are going to set you up for is chat and recruit. Recruitment difficulty 45. Actually, let's just friendly chat you because I want to wean you off while you are um, going through withdrawal. So if we accidentally on purpose kill you, then it sucks to be you. But if you're a colonist, then it sucks even harder. Medali, thank you very much for the follow. I appreciate that. And the other thing I can do is probably set that up to be thingy soon to just chat if you want to detox him yeah that's what I was doing actually yeah I've had someone uh, smoke themselves to death who was that that was um blue in my usual suspect series 
I think he was already frail or something. Went out for a bit of a smoke. Smoke in a pancake, bong in a blitz, crap in a cigar, and died. Right, we really need to get this harvesting done. So, work, plant cutting, more important. Off they go. Good! Because food supply is basically gone. Also, new recruit. Aha! We've got Clark. Marvellous. We also want to s kill a bunch more of the wildlife. We'll go for the rest of the hares. And then Mega Sloth. I'll leave it like that for the moment. Okay, so you have successfully recruited Clark. Clark, your abilities are... Psychopathic, careful shooter, but you can do other stuff. So. Let's have a think about this. You're going to do... Same on those as everyone else. You are not a hauler, so you can't do that. You can do flicking. Um, <laughs> you don't do very much. You could be my reserve cook, I guess. Though you are really terrible at it. You're actually a fairly decent beast handling. But we already have lots of people who do that. You're the best miner. So we're going to set you as a miner, for sure. And art, once we get to it. I think I am going to make you a backup cook. Because you do so little of anything else. I mean, later on, once we get onto art, that would be great. But honestly, we are still quite a long way away from that point. Clark is butchering. That's fine. Oh, hello. Ooh. I see possibilities here. That is open to the air. That That's like the perfect solar area. Or even an animal pasture right there. Pretty close to the kitchen for a butchering too. Interesting. Interesting. The artwork in this game is funny, yeah. The artwork in this game is brilliant. Right, we need those berries hauled in, people. Oh, that is a massive mega sloth. Corgi Martini and Irene Bell, thank you very much for the follows. I appreciate that. Hair self tamed. Um, sucks to be you. I'm seeing squirrels. Ah, here we go. Rats. Red foxes. Squirrels. Turkey. Lots of little guys to hunt down. We could also go for the muffalo. Although I think that muffalo can go manhunter. Does the shadows affect growth rate? No, but it does affect solar panels. So put solar panels where there's a lot of shade and it does affect them. Oh, we have some rice. Excellent. Okay. So food is going to be incoming very, very shortly. Sorry. Clark, you need a bed. In fact, we, we, we need more beds full stop. That's, there it is. In fact, cancel that. Bed. This is a barracks. You Turn it around. 33% withdrawal. Alright. Yeah, man Manhunter Muffalo are not something to uh, sneer at. Those things are dangerous. Right, next up we want another stockpile zone here. And we actually want to delete that one. That's going to give us another room, which is awesome. And then I think what we will do 
Because we're going to go ahead and mine the rest. No, you're not the stock... Hang on. That's the stockpile room. My bad. Stockpile room. It's getting... Here. Like so. Cargo pods, what do you give me? Hops! Um, I don't really care about hops right now. Unbelievable, I know. But right now I really don't. Yeah, Mega Horner, uh, Mega Horners? Mega Fauna looked interesting. I was looking quite seriously at that mod going, that's tempting, that's really quite tempting. Low medicine. Not that low. Believe me, I've been a lot lower. I'm so happy that we're getting the rice. I mean, we need to get that stuff hauled. But rice is good. Uh, also, in here, I'm going to ban all foods. And nothing rotten. Ooh, go juice. That's not good. So it was a really good thing that we got this guy over his addiction. Of go juice. Hopefully. Probably. Did I set this whole thing to be mined? That was a mistake. Go ahead and mine that area out. Nothing else. It's actually this area I was looking at. No, Siri. Stop turning yourself on. It's annoying. Okay, we are being raided by the night frogs. Three of them. Ben with a knife. Porthos with a heavy SMG. And a bolt action rifle. Right, so I have not built up any defenses at all. So once we have beaten off this raid, I think that's probably going to be the next thing.